Is there a reason that we deal with uh, two column vectors with one of them transposed in order to do an outer product as opposed to just being given a probe? Um, no, there's no reason. So, <laughs> Um, I, to be honest with you, when I was choosing this, I thought to myself, like, let's, um, okay, so formally speaking, yes, um, in the research literature to this field, so the Bible of matrix computation is a, a book called Golub and Van Loan. It's now in its fourth edition. Golub um, is an icon in this field. He's a very, very famous person. He helped create um, Google's algorithm to solve their page rank stuff. Uh, he had a, a license plate that said SVD prof. It's pretty cool. Uh, SVD, a singular value decomposition professor. Nobody smiled at that, so I guess. <laughs> yeah. um, he was a, an icon in this field, and um, he created a book that has basically linear algebra through the 1990s, the third edition to that book, anyways. Um, in that book, that they like to write their um, their rank one updates using an X and Y transpose. Um, and I think, to be honest with you, I've thought a lot about why we as linear algebra have the propensity to use column vectors, and I literally think it's because paper is longer than it is wide, and so it's much easier to list stuff down the page than it is to list stuff across the page. I, that might be off, right? Um, and then I also think that one of the things that happens a lot in um, algebra is we usually, because we read left to right, we normally multiply stuff on the left, right? And so when we think about a vector, if we multiply on the left, that thing has to be a column vector if we want that paradigm. You could do all of linear algebra with row vectors, but in that case, you'd be multiplying everything from the right, and it would be exactly opposite of how we read English, right? And so from that standpoint, I, there, there is a, 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 a very high inclination in linear algebra to use column vectors. So this definition of outer product depends only on column vectors, which fits into that portion of the field. You probably didn't need all that detail, huh? <laughs> Every bit of notation took me at least 15 hours of thought. I mean, over, spread over eight years, right? Yeah, but. <laughs>